Alright, well, um, lately I've been having problems with my headset, because uh, I just got this new headset, it's a HyperX Revolver, and uh, I've been trying to do a feedback for it, as in play back the um, device, or whatever. So typically what you would do is you go to your microphone, uh, go to listen, and hit the listen to device. That would essentially, it's taking your microphone, running it through your computer, and then it's coming back through your processor back up to your headset. So there's going to be a delay if you do this. And it was really annoying for me. I couldn't stand it. So I uh, tried looking into it, and there's apparently no fix. If uh, I mean, a lot of people have built their own computer like myself, and there's really no fix unless you have the right audio drivers for it. So you're going to um, first see if you have the right drivers in the first place. So to check that, you're going to go to Speakers, right-click, and then go to Properties and then hit levels and if you don't see this here then uh, you probably don't have the right driver that's not really that much of a problem if you already have Realtek drivers you probably just have to update it according to your um, uh, motherboard whatever mine's a gigabyte so I went to the gigabyte website here uh, you can essentially go home to products go to motherboard find whatever motherboard you have or and then uh, essentially just find the driver. You choose driver, choose your OS. Mine's Windows 10, and the first thing that should show up is Realtek Audio Driver here. Uh, that's what I downloaded and updated to this. Um, of course, not everyone here is going to have a gigabyte uh, motherboard. Uh, anyway, uh, you once you install that, you're going to have to reinstall or restart your computer, and then uh, go back to your speakers. Uh, hit right click, hit properties, go down, go to levels, and whatever, um, whatever jack you have your microphone plugged into in the back of your computer or laptop, I guess in whatever case, you should have color codings. If it's in the rear, if it's in the front, mine's plugged in the rear in the pink. So, yeah, yeah, I said that. Anyways, uh, this should just start at zero once you install your audio driver. So you put that up to fifty and then you should just be golden. I mean you can mess around with it a little more if you're still having problems go to here. I mean you can if your microphone's muted you might have that problem. You can just go to listen and unmute it or I mean levels and unmute it. And then uh, another thing you have to make sure is that you have the microphone boost on. If you don't have this on it's not going to record your voice and send it back through your headset at all. So I keep mine at 20 decibels and about at 40 with the microphone. That seems to be a pretty comfortable level for me. You can mess around with it some more. And thanks to my friend for finding this because I searched through hours worth of forums and threads and I could not find anything on how to explain this. And we finally found a way around, even for people who don't have the right drivers. But for Windows 10 or Windows in general, you should be able to update to Realtek drivers. I would not recommend going to their website and downloading them because those are just the general drivers. They're actually really out of date. So try to find either your graphics card audio drivers, your sound card audio drivers, something that's from the hardware that you have in your computer and you should be golden. Um, that's about all I have to say. It's just props to my friend for finding this. See ya.